The Fox Cities Marathon is only a day away. But festivities for the event have been going on all weekend. Emily Dean joins us now with more. Hi, Emily. Good morning, you guys. Yeah, the music's playing. We're here for day two of the festivities for the marathon, Fox Cities Marathon. And Amanda joins us now. And you're with Fox Cities Marathon. And there are events th that started yesterday and now continue today. So tell us, how, how much work does it go in to prepare for a huge marathon like this? We plan for the marathon all year long. We have got two full-time employees that work on it 365 days a year because it's a whole weekend of events. It starts on Friday. We started yesterday with packet pickup and the kids' fun run at Fox City Stadium. Today we've got our Time Warner Cable 5K going on to start the morning. Our expo and registration will continue. And tomorrow morning, of course, we've got our distance runs. We have the Community First Fox City's Marathon and the Half Marathon and Relay Marathon as well. Now what's happening right now? Right now, we're getting ready for the start of our 5K. So we've got folks coming in and registering. We've got the music here so they can get pumped up. They're going to do some stretching. We're going to um, send everyone off at 8 o'clock on the 5K run this morning. How many do people do you expect to come out and run or run walk this morning for the 5K? This morning, um, our numbers are already over 1,300, and our cap is 1,500. So we think we're going to hit our cap this year, um, our largest group ever for the Time Warner Cable 5K. Now, what do you see different each year? This has been going on for 20 years. Not this per se, but the Fox City's marathon has been going on for 20 years and this kind of evolved the festivities what do you see change each year the marathon has grown from being a, a single event a 26.2 mile distance marathon and over time because of the community and the sponsorship and the volunteers and the, the interest it's grown to be a full festival of races so that's where we have now a whole weekend of events that kicks off friday continues saturday and into sunday and it, the wonderful thing is it's events for all all ages all abilities so if you're someone that wants to come out and just have fun in a 5k it's a very doable distance if you want to challenge yourself with the longer runs and then we've also got the kids run in the expo so there's really something for everybody and we take we use 2300 volunteers to make this happen so it is about a community coming together to make this happen every year now tell us too what else is happening today Today, um, after the 5K, we're going to continue with packet pickup for our Sunday events. If someone hasn't registered for the Sunday events, if they'd like to come down to Fox Valley Technical College in Appleton, we're here until 6 o'clock taking registrations, and our expo will also continue. We've got a lot of vendors in there with great sports and fitness-related equipment, so you can learn a little something and maybe pick up some new equipment. Okay, Amanda, it looks great. Everybody's getting ready for the big race today, the 5K walk and run. We'll send it back to you guys. All right, a lot of people up there. Out there getting ready and it's nice that they're starting with a little sunshine too. Thanks, awesome. thanks Emily. Bye guys. Enjoy home